leg and torso measurements. Leg and torso measurements answer two basic questions. Is your torso longer than your legs? Or are your legs longer than your torso? And if you were to compare your upper leg to your lower leg, which would be the longer? Leg and torso ratios provide interesting and useful information about the levels of growth factor hormones you encountered in the womb and early childhood. In order to do these measurements, you will need a tape measure, a straight back kitchen chair, and the assistance of a friend. Let's go through this step by step. First, let's begin with your overall height. Stand straight in your stocking feet with a book on your head to make sure your head is level. Have your friend measure from the bottom of the book straight down to the floor. You can stand on the tape measure tab and bring the tape measure up to the book if this is easier to do. Record your height on worksheet one. Second, let's determine your sitting height. For this, you'll need your kitchen chair and the tape measure. Sit in the chair and place the book on your head. Have your friend measure from the floor to the bottom of the book. Record this number on the worksheet as your sitting height. Next, determine the height of the chair by taking your tape measure and measuring from the top of the chair seat to the ground. Record the chair height. The online calculator will use the chair height and your sitting height to determine the length of your torso. Then, use your torso length and total height to compute your total leg length. Let's move on to measuring your lower and upper leg. As you sit straight in the chair, have your friend measure up the side of your leg, starting from the place where your ankle sticks out the farthest and ending at the bump on the outer side of your leg just below your kneecap. If you are carrying excess weight, you may have trouble finding the bump. If so, just feel your knee until you can find it. Keep your hand there to mark the spot and measure from this point down to the ankle. Record your lower leg length on your worksheet. To calculate your upper leg length, you will need to sit in the chair and feel for the long skin crease between your hip and your leg. Mark this spot with a finger. Have your friend place their fingers on your kneecap, then slide their fingertips upward until they are off your kneecap and fall into the groove above the knee. This is your upper leg length. Great! Now that you have all the measurements, enter them into the online genotype calculator. For more information on leg and torso measurements, refer to pages 58 to 60 in the Genotype Diet book.